Hey guys and welcome back to Tanks Gaming with another Armored Warfare video. Today I'm gonna show you the T-72 Ural the Ice Edition, which was also in the, in my ice package of course. Um, like I did in the last uh, videos, showcase videos, I will start off with a PvE match and show you also PvP battle how I do in there. So to start it off, I'm going to log on in a PvP, a PvE match, and I bring you back as soon as it's loaded, guys. And I'm back, guys, and we are on the PvE mission Tsunami. Um, you've seen me play this mission before. Uh, you have three intel tracks where you can get intel trucks where you can get uh, in gather intel, which is the bonus objective, and gives you a little bit more money in the end. And you have to capture the harbor, the port. Okay. Uh, there are two Urals, a T-72 Urals on my team and a Begleit Panzer. Begleit Panzer is actually a German word and means, uh, well, just like a support tank. We did 400 damage and actually hit the ammo rack of that tank. Uh, the Chieftain has but the Chieftain has the better armor than I do. So, ooh, I actually bounced one. And my gun depression is really horrible. No penetration. Okay, I don't get through with Sabo. Interesting to know. And this one, oops. Ah, oh boy! Ah, uh, the Ural actually. Man, oh, there is a boss tank. An M60A3. No, it do, nah, I was too slow. Always too slow to get the he big heavy tank. <laughs> enemy tanks. I'm also down half health already, uh, so I probably play it a little bit wrong, I would say. Going to switch back to my, I think that's just armor piercing ammunition, not like heat or anything. So he's going to gather this intel, I think I should nice turn to the right, I might be able to get some damage in over there, oh look there, an enemy artillery, yep, I got a nice hit on that one. Probably would have blown him up with high explosives or with heat, which would have entered and exploded inside, not like a, like a shot that goes through the enemy tank. Ah, boy, why didn't I press? Why didn't I press my mouse button right there? And zoom in and tack. A ricochet. Okay, so the Ural's penetration could be better. Okay, I didn't say anything. But I guess that was like a light tank or anything like that. Uh, okay, there are some more enemies. He blows up before I actually can even can zoom in cor cor correctly. Uh, I'm actually going to support the Chieftain up here. Or support. Follow the Chieftain. I think he can take a little bit more on hits than I can. But we will see. We are actually on the way to, cap to the capture port. Uh, by the way guys, this is a hard difficulty. Um, like you know from another video, I have never finished a hard mission. Uh, meaning I always blow up earlier. Uh, we probably w I probably have won a hard mission yet, but before, but I was never alive for uh, to actually see the victory, so to say. I'm hoping there is nothing spawning behind me or coming in behind me. That would really re would be really really bad. Ooh, there is something over there. Can I shoot between? No, I can't. There is something spawning up there. Uh, something spawned behind me as well. I need to get over here to have some friendly tanks between me and them, or I'll be blown up to bits. I got a nice shot through this container and uh, forklift or no 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 don't drive in my firing lane don't drive in my firing lane Ooh, artillery ouch okay another artillery spawned enemy artillery um, I was actually too slow to start and the artillery chose me as target which is very nice of the artillery I'm very grateful for that I'm not spotted at the moment, which should probably mean uh, there is the artillery. It's way too far away. I can't do anything against it. 
Um, no, he actually didn't drive between these barracks or containers or whatever that st stuff is over there. So I'm going to drive up a little again. And hope I can inflict some more damage. I actually just have one kill so far. Which won't give me great stats on... Ah, boy! I should have waited to aim in completely. So I was a bit too far away to go for a, like a hip fire shot or not fully aimed shot, but that's how you learn. The limits of the of your tank. Um, actually driving in here. I think they blew up the artillery, right? I'm going to drive out the circle again. Nah. Uh, yeah, I did. Going for the hunt for the chief. Uh, what is it? MK six or is it a five? I can't really read it. It's a 5. So it's the same like a uh, chieftain like we have in our team. And can I get through here? I can. Can I see him from here? I could for a second. But really just for a second. I can see him. Uh, might have even saved our friend. Probably not. He probably didn't need saving. No, he didn't. He's nearly on full health. But I got another kill, which is also very nice. And there is the chieftain showing us his lightly armored backside or ass. <laughs> and I guess uh, that was actually the last one. So I'm driving in back to the cap circle. And I hope the guys won't get mad if because I cap, but I'm down to 467 health. And I would really like to finish a hard mission, or well, I would be alive when we finish a hard mission. Damn it! I got a ricochet, but he as well. Ooh. Boy, oh boy. I would say that was pure luck. Ooh, they blew him up already. Very nice. <laughs> It would have been nice if I did actually got another kill, which gives us more experience and more credits and everything in the end. But hey, better this than blowing up. And see him in, I can't see him, I can't see him, I can't see, I can't see him. I can't get through to him. Yep, just through the cap, man, this is cupola. And I'm going to drive into the cap circle, I don't care what the guys say. I'm nearly dead. And I might get a shot on him off from here. I do. Oh, he blew up. That's bad. Oops. I'm going to cap, guys. I don't care. <laughs> the easy win. Yeah, well, that's not so easy. I'm tempted to drive out to shoot them. I'm really tempted. But I'm not going to. I'm not going to, I'm going to stay in the cap circle, let these guys, let those tanks come to me if they want to kill me. Where do they see me? Ouch. Turn, 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 turn. I'm stuck between two trucks. I'm going to blow up because of two damn trucks. Please load, please load, please load, please load, please load. Ooh. But they reset the cap. I'm not spotted anymore. I guess that was really just... Yeah, there is another one coming. I need to get out of here. <laughs> help, guys. Please help me. I don't want to be destroyed. I'm down to 218 HPs. Uh, there is... What is it? Stingray too. Ah, uh, boy. I might get in a sneak shot onto the Stingray from the side. He might blow me up. We will see. Ooh, he's lucky. He is lucky. I suck at shooting under train carts. I actually can't see him here right now. Yeah, there I can see him, but I can't aim him. I don't get the aiming for it. Boy. He spotted me. As well as did this tank down there, but 
those guys should actually be close enough to him to get this aggro. Did you just shoot at me? Identified. Awful, thanks. There was something I could actually penetrate. Ricochet. I got a ricochet of it. Should switch to heat. Uh, don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. Would be nice if I could shoot through down here, but I probably can't. Don't want to drive up there. He's going to blow me up. I don't like this game anymore. <laughs> well, I still do. I think it's a fun game, guys. I'll give it a try. No, I can't go through under the train card. I blew up because I drove into a... Oh, boy. <laughs> because I drove into a truck. Oh, man. Or did somebody shoot me? I don't really know. I don't really know, guys. Uh, that's actually the last tank we have on our team. I got, I'm down on three kills. Well, I'm going to bring you guys back as soon as I've loaded a PvP battle, guys. Hey, guys, and I'm back. Uh, still in my in my Ural 72 or my T72 Ural. Uh, Ice edition. Uh, main battle tank. Uh, I think Ural is for the Russian or Soviet region, the Ural, the Ural uh, we call it in German. Uh, I could be wrong, uh, so don't quote me on that. Don't use that for your homework or anything. <laughs> uh, read it up if it's right or not. <coughs> so on this map I actually never started on this side, I always start on the other side. Um, so I guess I'm on a good course, I hope I'm on a good course. I will see. Uh, this time I'm actually the only ice tank in, in this battle. There are no other ice tanks. Uh, I don't the pre probably are. I mean, I, don't. I should really play this game a little bit more to learn all the different tanks and everything. But there are just so many hours in one day and I still have a job. Ooh, that was close. That would have been a nice kill, very long distant. So there are, there is a chief in MK5 up there. Uh, I don't think my leopard friend, okay it's a leopard 1. It's not a tier 5, no, I think that's a tier 4, the leopard. A leopard, the German main battle tank. Which actually also used, uh, the leopard 2 is also used in the Swiss army. So, just a little bit upgraded by Ruak. Which is a very good company, I would say. I'm not quite sure. I'm probably a little bit biased. Because I'm Swiss, I think they're very good. But hey, the Swiss army knives are very good, right? Everybody loves the Swiss army knife, so why shouldn't be the company any good? Yep! Down through the lower plate to the Chieftain MK5. It did actually do some damage. But that's nearly anything I can hit. Uh, he's actually shooting at me. Ooh, he did some damage. He did a good, lot of, a good amount of damage, actually. Commander Capola. Yep. Ah, oh, he moved just in a nick of time to, to let me bounce. I have to wait for a second or two to actually disappear again from the radar of those guys. I move up a little bit because I'm concealed at the moment. They can't see me. They will be able to see me as soon as I open fire again. Mm -hmm. Lower plate, lower plate, yes. You see, as soon as I fired, the spotted symbol popped back up again. So I'll move, look over there. Uh, damn it, I can't really shoot at him. Can't shoot at him though. Oh, it's too far away to actually get a good shot in. Should I try it one more time? I think he blew up. So I'll move up to the front again. Can't see the chieftain. I'm spotted. I can see this one. Missed him completely. So I drive back again. Wait till I disappear from the radar. Okay, he got blown up by our anti-tank friend over there. Move up again a little bit. I'm not spotted. Still not spotted. Still not spotted. See the chieftain. Uh, chieftain got this disappeared. Chieftain is back. Zoom in on his commander, Capiola. Commander's hatchet missed. 
should drive back before I get spotted. I am spotted. I don't know if that was lag or if it just takes a few seconds to happen. So if I drive up again, they shouldn't see me. I can't see them either. Oh, they see me. Why do they see me? Was I too close to the bush? We got artillery incoming. Artillery doesn't like us anymore. I'm spotted. I should check. Ah, this rock is cover. I was lucky the artillery hit the... Uh, I don't know how you call it. Exhaust pipe or... Chimney of this factory. That what actually saved me. Oh look, there is an anti-tank. There was an anti-tank. <laughs> So if you use the main battle tank, the Ural, um, to his advantage, I would say it's quite an accurate gun. I, at least I did some good damage on, on distance. But I think I can't do much more from here. I guess I have to drive in there if I want to do any more damage to anybody. I think we are going to win this. Um, because I said that now we're probably gonna lose horribly but chances are still here for us to win uh, what is it it's another T 72 euro up front and the rest is actually across the map ah you're gonna blow him up you don't need my help for that and boom oh boom no, not yet. Now, boom. Yep. Uh, so, this side of the map we have completely in the back. It's ours. The enemy has nothing over here. Unfortunately, the right flank uh, or the zero line was wide open. And we just lost an anti tank, meaning a big gun. To, uh, I think it was a T62, right? Not quite sure. T should be sound down here somewhere. Um, I should actually see him. Uh, T46. It was a T46. But where did he go? Where did he go? I'm not a scout tank, guys. Go scout for me. Drive a little bit up. Did he blow up? Yep, they blew him up. Or he drowned, probably. Yeah, has drowned. He drowned himself. You see that over there? That's a drowned dick. I don't know if he did it on purpose or if it just happened. I'm going to think it's just happened. I won't say he is a douchebag. He didn't. He saw that they are losing and I didn't want anybody to get any XP. But it could be. It could be. Like you see, if I would... It's pretty bad tank to cross water. <laughs> If I would have stopped in the middle of this crossing, I would have drowned, and at the end as well. You saw I had 9 seconds time to actually leave the water. Uh, one thing I really like about this game is actually the, uh, the minimap. Damn it. That's what I thought. They actually drove across the water up here. They are now capping our base. And... I haven't got a shot. Why can't he up there? He is. Ah, oh, that blew him up. Ah, oh, but there is another tank over there. Because I did got some damage. Or was this his shot? Is the, other, is the anti tank still in town? I don't know. But I'm not crossing where the T60 46 tried to cross. Uh, 64, sorry. T64 tried to cross because I think he tried to cross just over there and that's why he drowned. I will cross here where the water is nice and shallow. So I actually survived that. So I guess he really didn't do it on purpose. He was just like unlucky that he didn't know the depth of the water and the reduced speed of his tank in the water. Boy, where are they? One was up in town, but those the BMD and the OR40 actually drove. Oops, <laughs> I should focus on the road, not on the minimap. Uh, the BF, uh, the OF4 and the BMD1 actually drove through that town, and they didn't saw an enemy. 
So I'm not quite sure where they, where he could be, or where they could be. Uh, two anti tanks they're hiding somewhere. They're not actually shooting uh, at the at their own capture point. You think they're up here? I'm driving up there. That was my la my my last position actually, where I was fighting from. But somebody just marked it on the map. You saw it. It was uh, what was it? B9 and C9 or uh, C9 and D9. Uh, attention on this side. Okay. Ah, he was pro. He was nearly right. There is the laugh. And there is the other one. Both of them were over here. Interesting. And zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. Boom. Goodbye. Yes, I got the last one. You're lucky, but I got it. <laughs> so anyway, guys, that was the Euro T72 Euro on a PvP battle, and I enjoyed to play this tank in the PvP more than in the PvE for some reason. Normally, I like PvE more. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please hit the like button, and you can also subscribe to my channel if you want to see more daily videos. And you can also follow me on Facebook or Twitter if you like to. Uh, all the links are in the description. And I would like to say one more time, thank you for watching guys. And I hope to see you next time. Bye.